So the time is here guys, my uh, two days karate camp, and I'll be taking you guys with me. Um, I'm here in my room, showing you guys the date, uh, packing my clothes up now, it's a bit mess here. Getting everything ready, you guys see my camp uh, back below there and everything, and then I'm leaving in about an hour. In the car now, just left my home place, on the way now. Uh, showing you guys a bit of a scenery. Halfway there now. Feeling a bit uh, tired. A bit drained. Just arrived now to the city. The buildings now around. It was like a five, six hours trip with traffic. And yes. Finally arrived at the venue. The uh, Hithcourt Scout Camp, Sydney. Uh, but for the next two days, it's going to be our Australian Christian Karate Association's uh, Karate Camp. Uh, people from this uh, state, New South Wales, will be here from different dojos. It's a good place. You know, nature, it's a bit far from the city. In the nature, there's a trees around, hills, nature vibe, and a good break. So I'm just showing you guys around, uh, taking you guys in there now. That's our March summer camp. And there is another one in September. This, that's the winter camp. There's two camps in a year. Uh, it's the first morning now. It's like around 4.50. There is the um, head instructor going around people's uh, rooms and waking everyone up. Getting ready for our first training session. It starts at 5.30. Getting refreshed now, waking myself up, getting ready for the uh, training. Only have like 20 minutes left. The training goes for like an hour. Alright, so I'm all uh, ready now to go. Uh, everyone's already up there, most people. Um, I'm not late, but I thought I was running late, so I was running a little bit there. Uh, still had 15 minutes left, but everyone was already there and they're early. And outside, it's still pitch dark and it's still very early in the morning it's like 5 10 there right now currently uh now it's not that hot but in winter in the next camp it will be very cold in the morning and everyone's already in there in that light of um building there ready as you can see stretching talking everyone there gathered coming out from a from an hour of a session in the morning it was a bit hard uh, doing karate in the early morning uh, the sun is slowly rising now. It's a bit Just had a shower, feeling refreshed now for the training session. Uh, showing you guys the morning scenery outside. It's a peaceful vibe, refreshed. Um, showing you guys around. That's the buildings where we live. Uh, one for male, one for female. Attached bathrooms. Training session there, one training building. The hills in the distance. It's very naturey, birds shipping away from the city, quiet. Found this um, awesome looking star sort of thing, part of, a part of like a scout thing here. Uh, with that, I'll show you guys around again. Uh, the view of the sunrise now, just the uh, yellowish sunlight reflection on the trees looking so good. That's the uh, upper grassland uh, where we do also train in the daytime in the grass too uh, people's ski hanging on the fence line drying up uh, from the session it's just so clear sky now for some uh, breaky oh, I was feeling so hungry from the first training session it uh, really burned the energy out and also the breakfast here is very famous you know these guys have been working here for like around 20 years and they have kept the same taste you know the commitment and dedication is just insane the, the foods are here are very good we get three foods uh, a day breakfast lunch and dinner and the breakfast is my uh, sort of favorite meal of the day you know, being honest there's so much variety i'm uh, getting some Bacon, sausages, hash browns, uh, there's some beans there, and then there's like a tomatoes, fried tomatoes, there's an onion, uh, 
uh, what is it, um, eggs and jams, sauces and everything, you know, and everyone's just eating the meal, because everyone's hungry too, you know, and then there is my food, yummy, it was very good, man, it was busting, and just getting my drink there earlier that I put over there. Alright, now it's time for the second training session of the day. And then now this one goes for two hours. I'm gonna have it. And there is another one which also goes for two hours. So another two sessions uh, going for four hours altogether. And heading up in the same uh, place, the same building now. It's a beautiful day now, it's beautiful outside, it's sunny. And also, yeah, I dropped my bottle there, <laughs> so picking it up. Just silly me. And then you're yeah, heading there. <laughs> Thanks to my uh, teacher for filming some shots for me and then this is it guys this is us training in the venue uh, the rows and lines the black belts in the front, followed by the brown belts, and the green, yellow, blue, red, and they're all in levels. The two instructors there, including my teacher who's filming right now, there's three there. Um, just doing some fighting techniques, punches. And look, that's me now. I'm a uh, senior green belt, uh, two belts away from a black belt. I've been doing karate for nearly three years now. And uh, one day I'm hoping to get my brown black belt. I mean black belt. And everyone's doing the very best. Now it's time for the second meal of the day, the lunch. I'm uh, pretty hungry too now from the second two-hour session. Uh, let's get. And here is my plate, full of foods, full of carbs. Yummy. So now it's time for the uh, third session, which goes for two hours too. I'm wearing a hat because I think we're going outside, because we usually do go outside, but I don't know, it's a bit too sunny, so I'm not sure if we are or not, but just in case, I'm bringing a hat with me, uh, yep, so let's go. Turns out that it is too hot outside, so when I go in there, we just start staying inside, and there's me again, uh, we all are doing a kata now, uh, just the senior greens and under that's doing this, so the black girls there are standing and watching us. Uh, it's a bit of a pressure and uh, stress that we're doing in front of them. Uh, but hey, it's a good way to learn. And now there is all of us now here uh, doing combination practices, a uh, combination of blocks and strikes and stances. So we finished with the session now. Uh, we also finished all the three sessions now, so we don't have to do any more. Now it's just the uh, guys that are grading tomorrow for the next belt doing the fitness test. Uh, this is done on the first day too. They're doing the push-ups, sit-ups, squats, push-up on the knuckles, uh, star jumps, kicks, and etc. So after that, it is the um, dinner time, the last meal of the day. Uh, now everyone's enjoying their dinner. We have the uh, rice, spaghetti, uh, beef beans, and a uh, lamb curry. It's not a big uh, option for dinner, but it's, it's light. Uh, to be honest, but dinner is not really my favorite uh, meal of that uh, for camp, uh, but it's not that bad. Can I get some of that? This one? Yeah, this, this one, this here. Yes. Just, just a little bit though, not too much. Half, half of that, yeah, thank you. And then, yeah.
And there is it. That's my last plate of the day. Let's eat. After dinner, we into the last part, last activity of the day, which is the uh, talent show, where we tell like jokes, you know, riddles, which just show our talent. To everyone, just like a fun activity. It's uh, pretty dark now, and uh, we're still going. We went for like two hours. Uh, each and everyone has to go, so it takes time. Day two, the last day, uh, heading to the first training session that goes for one hour. And there's one more after this, which goes for two hour. And then after this, there's the uh, grading that starts at from 1.30 and then goes for as long as it takes, like uh, around five hours, six hours. And they do katas, they do block strikes, combinations, sparring and everything there. It's a long grading. Um, and then, then we did some uh, photo shoot too, for, uh, clicking photos with other dojos, your own dojos, instructors, uh, for memories. I'm moving straight to the grading now. Uh, took some video shots of the grading. It's my first time seeing a grading from a third point of view. Uh, my f first camp, uh, which was my last camp. Uh, this is my second camp. In my first camp, I actually graded, so I couldn't really see the grade grading. Uh, you can see the you know, teachers there walking, the, the instructor. Uh, the audience is there watching. And uh, good luck to everyone. Alright, so after watching the grading for some few hours, uh, I'm heading out now. Uh, so most of the students have already left earlier before the grading. And, uh, because I'm grading my next camp, so I just, so I just watched like how it goes, the structure and everything, just so I'm ready. It was a good camp, good two days, a uh, good break from the, you know, busy life, work. Very excited to uh, come back again in about a few months. Uh, so thank you guys for watching my first uh, voiceover video. Good luck, did my best.